Hey guys, I got a new video for you today, and today we're going to be looking at the Oakley M-Frame Alpha. The Alpha is the newest addition to the Oakley standard issue site, and they're calling this an ecosystem because it is comprised of a three-part system in which a single lens works across all the platforms. The system is made up of a halo goggle, a halo gasket, and the Alpha M-Frame. Now in the past, if you had a frame and a goggle, each of them had to have their own specific lenses in order to swap out to adjust to different environments. With this new Alpha ecosystem, one lens would be able to share across all the system. So in other words, the same lens can be used for the goggles as it can be used for the frame as it can adapt the helo gasket to it. So let's go ahead and take a look at it. As you guys can see, it comes in this array box with the Alpha patch in the front the werewolf chomping down on the icon there. When you open it up, you're presented with quite a few things inside. We'll take some of the bigger items out. So you have a large microfiber bag. That's going to be for your goggles. Then you have a smaller microfiber bag for your frame. From the back to the front, as you guys can see, you have your frame. You have a couple different lenses and then you have your goggles here. As I already mentioned, all the lenses will be accommodated in either the goggle or the frame. So with everything that you have in this box, you can adapt it to any circumstance that you might need. Take the frame out to make some room. We'll start with the pocket back here. You have some information as far as how to switch out the lenses on the M-Frame Alpha. In the smaller pocket back here, you have first a refill of the um, anti-fog solution. So as you clean your lenses, it's always good to go ahead and apply that anti-fog solution on there so your lenses don't fog up. And then you have the strap for the uh, Alpha M frame, which you can attach to the back of the stems. In the first slot here, you have a gray lens. And you have a clear lens. And then you have your goggles. Now, the other two lens color options in this kit are the TR-22 and TR-45 prism shooting specific lenses, which have already been equipped on the frame and on the goggle. But again, all of these lenses can be interchanged in between the frame and the goggle. So if you want a clear lens on the goggle, you can go ahead and put that in there. And then if you want it on the frame, you can take it off from the goggle and put it onto the frame. So let's take a look at the frame here now. Now the frame is already riding the Hilo gasket, as you guys can see there. And what this does is it gives you uh, more, gives you the ability to block out a lot of the wind dust and sand that might be coming in from the sides as you're wearing your M frame. They're easily removable, but they are very comfortable and it's a very tight and secure fit. So here's the frame itself. The frames are ballistic and impact resistant. They are ANSI stamped. So you guys can see there, SIM frame, alpha. made in the USA. The stems are nice and thin, so they will accommodate underneath over the ear hearing protection and communication devices. The lens shape that they went with is very reminiscent of the hybrid lens shape that you would find on the M frame. Figured that that's the cut that would pretty much suit the majority of people. Now, one really awesome thing about this frame is that the frame itself has vents cut into the top right here. What that allows is for constant airflow to further not allow the lenses to fog. Now, if you're familiar with Oakley lenses, a lot of times um, you had to purchase specific lenses that had cutouts in order to give you that. But for this, any lens that is in the system that you put in here is going to be vented because the vents are actually on the frame itself. And I think that's a really big plus. 
It's very easy to interchange the lenses uh, on the frame itself. It's a familiar locking device like you would find on a radar lock. So basically you have a little pin back here that you push in and that releases the store right here. And all you have to do is pop the lenses out and then swap in whichever lens color you want to. To put them back in, just do the reverse. It has a hook right there in the middle, which hooks in. And once that's done, you can just go ahead and close the door. And there you go. As for the helo gasket, to attach it onto the frame is very simple. All you have to do is snap it on the top right here and push it down. And as you guys can see, it fits around the existing nose piece there very for a very comfortable and secure fit. Onto the goggles. The goggles are designed to be able to be worn with uh, different equipment, so different helmets, uh, different masks. These will accommodate and fit very nicely. They're very low profile, very comfortable with the three-point foam cell right back here. And obviously they're designed to be able to um, not fog up by allowing constant airflow as well. There's different straps that are available. The one that came with this one has the rubber lines on the inside and Velcro on the back. This allows you to either wear it alone or you can attach it to the outside of a helmet uh, or other type of gear. You are able to remove them from here and attach other strap systems, which would be available through the standard issue site. Now I'll go ahead and roll in a little film that Oakley prepared so you guys can see these in action. Now there were some questions that came up regarding who this ecosystem is intended for. And for the most part, this is intended for anybody that needs for their equipment to be able to adapt for whatever circumstance they might be in. For example, a soldier standing post wearing their M-Frame Alpha, which is called to maybe assist in landing a helo. They can go ahead and put in their gaskets and now they don't have to worry about the wind coming in the sides and bothering them. Then again, they might be called up to parachute out of an airplane and go ahead and throw on their goggles and be ready to go. So for the most part, this is intended for that person that wants a complete kit ready and available for whatever circumstance might come up. Alright guys, so as always I'll go ahead and put these on so you guys can see what they look like. I'll start with the frame alone. Uh, there it is. It is very comfortable, very lightweight. Uh, it's definitely going to stay where you put them. The unobtainium on the nose is going to allow that if you do perspire, it's going to bond more to your skin so they won't be sliding down. These straight stems all the way back are very comfortable. And especially if you're going to be wearing over-the-ear hearing protection or comms or something like that, they're not going to get in the way. The venting is going to allow for constant airflow, so you're not going to have to worry about the lenses fogging. And it has a really nice wrap to it, so it's going to give you good coverage you know, on the top, on the bottom, and on the sides as well. So I'll go ahead and add the gasket on there so you guys can see what that looks like. Again, it's very simple. Just uh, go over the frame and clip it in. And then just make sure that it sits up against the nose pad. And we'll put these on. 
So as you guys can tell, um, you know, it has really good protection. It comes almost all the way to the end of the frame. And that's exactly what you need. You want to make sure that it goes all the way around your eye and it sits in there so that it blocks all the debris, all, you know, sand, dust and things like that. Because that's the last thing you need, especially when you're on a mission, is uh, to, to be able to, you know, to, to have that being blocked out so it doesn't jeopardize it. Okay, and last but not least is gonna be the goggles. So again, with the supplied strap that has the Velcro on the back, you can go ahead and uh, just wear them like this, or um, you can, you know, if you have a helmet that has the Velcro on it, you can go ahead and Velcro the um, goggles directly onto the helmet. So that's gonna give you an extra level of retention and comfort. But as it is, the goggles have a very low profile, so they're not gonna get in the way with your headgear or if you're wearing any type of breathing apparatus or anything like that, it's gonna be very comfortable. That three foam cell all the way around allows you to wear it and not have to worry about it becoming um, uh, cumbersome or anything like that, especially if you're gonna be wearing them for a prolonged amount of time, they are very comfortable. So there it is. That is the new ecosystem from Oakley Standard Issue, the M-Frame Alpha, which includes the frame, the gasket and the goggles. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Thanks.